So I was going to hold this bag up for the thumbnail, but a certain someone has taken a liking to the bag. Hey guys, so today I am going to be filming a what I got for Christmas video. I wasn't sure if I was going to do one of these because I was like, Am I a little bit old? I'm nearly 25. Am I a bit old to do one of these videos? Because for Christmas, I now ask for like practical things and I wasn't really sure if you guys would want to see them. They're all a bit adulty, so Not like in that kind of way, but like, you know, they're adult things. But I just thought, F it, I'm going to do one anyway. So I hope you guys enjoy it. So my main present from my mum and dad was actually a dishwasher. Obviously I can't show it to you right now. Imagine that if I just lifted it up, like, oh, here it is. I can't show it to you right now. It'd be a little bit heavy and it's obviously like installed into the kitchen. My dad came and did it. In fact, we've had it for quite a while. We got given this present early because my dad wanted to come and like fit it into the slot and all that kind of stuff. I'm glad we now have a dishwasher. It's been so nice having one. So we were very thankful for our dishwasher. I'm sure you guys will see it when I finally do a house tour, which should be in the next couple of months. I basically, we Basically, we decided we wanted to do something with the kitchen. So until we've done that, I'm holding off on doing the house tour because I think it's gonna look really cute. So there will be one in a couple of months. So the next thing my mum and dad got us was actually a slow cooker. There he goes. He's a bit heavy, I tell you. Some of these are gonna be, oh, actually, how am I gonna hold that one up? We've got some heavy items, but I'm gonna do my best. I'm not very strong. It's copper, a copper slow cooker. I need both hands. <laughs> How cute is that? I mean, I never thought I'd say a slow cooker was cute, but it's a pretty cute one. And this is just gonna be really good for cooking, obviously. For some reason, there's chocolate crumbs all over it, but this is the The Slow Cook book. So it's a cookbook, especially for the slow cooker, if you know what I mean. So it's got a load of different recipes. There's also desserts on there, which is probably my favorite part. So yeah, maybe I'll actually learn to cook this year. My mum and dad also got us these tea towels. They're just some little gray and white tea towels. And this, I tell you, matches our mugs spot on. Like that is the exact pattern of our mugs. So my mum and dad also got us some new hand towels and they came in this really cute little white and coppery basket, which I thought was so cute. And yeah, we've already got some pastel pink hand towels, but they've gotten so scabby. So I was gonna buy some new ones actually, but now I don't need to, cause we've already got a load of new ones. They just got really scabby and no matter how many times I washed them, they still looked grubby. So I was like, nah. <laughs> Nah, mate. They also got me these bath foams in the scent Frosted Sprinkles. It's from the brand Donut Shop. And this is so funny because I also got my mum something from this exact brand because I was like, mum, got these because you love Krispy Kremes. My mum did, <laughs> I know it's not Krispy Kreme, but it's still a donut. And my mum did exactly the same. They smell so good. So I'm really excited to use those. And the packaging is actually adorable so yeah i'm really excited to try those they got me this really cute little scarf it's gray and white and it's got this really nice like i don't know what the pattern's called but i tell you it's so similar to my onesie they go so well together i don't know why if ever i'm showing a scarf i have to just put it around my neck briefly there we go <laughs> What should we do next? Oh, I've got some pants. Do you want to see my pants? <laughs> my mum got me a load of pants. The only time I ever get new underwear is when my mum gets me some for Christmas each year. I just wear the same stuff. Well, obviously like I wash it, but I wear the same stuff. Thanks mum, sorting me out for the year. <laughs> and if you're wondering where the car air fr f f what? If you're wondering where the car air fresheners are, they're here. If you've watched my channel for a long time, you'll know I always get some car air fresh. Why can't I say that? It always comes out as air fresh. I always get a car air freshener or two. In fact, it's always two, I think. Lovely. <laughs> I have absolutely no idea how I'm gonna show you this, but I'm gonna try my best. I've actually had this for quite a while. My mum gave this to me, I swear it was like a couple of months ago because it arrived and she was like, I don't know how I'm gonna wrap this up. So do you want it now? And I was like, all right then. <laughs> It's actually what I've been sitting on to film my videos for the past couple of months. Not today, obviously. I'm sat on a chair today because I knew that I wanted to show it. <laughs> this is going to be so difficult to show, but it's basically a giant, like, stool poof, whatever you call it. And it's got these little wooden legs and then it's this, like pink um i don't really know what you'd call that texture but you can probably see what it is look how big it is though like it is huge and it's just been so handy because before this i'm gonna put it down i was filming my videos either sat on the floor or sat on alex's toolbox which i tell you it wasn't very comfortable so yeah i absolutely love that i'm actually out of breath from lifting it <sighs> my thing for 2019 is i'm gonna actually get fit for once because i'm worried about myself <laughs> 
So my mum and dad also got us all some really cute like Christmassy things to wear on Christmas day and I got this adorable Christmas jumper but obviously I was wearing my outfit that you guys chose. If you don't know what I'm talking about I did a video where my subscribers bought my Christmas outfits. I ended up going for the jumper with the trousers. It was a very comfy to, to it was a very comfy decision, so yeah, I really liked wearing that, but it meant that I couldn't wear my Christmas jumper, and I don't know why I didn't wear it on Boxing Day. Um, so it means I've got a Christmas jumper ready for next year, and it is so cute. It's this really nice grey jumper with these little sequin gingerbread men on them. I'm already sorted for December 2019. I also got the cutest little Christmas earrings, and I ended up wearing the candy cane ones. I bet you can't see them from here. They're just so cute, so I absolutely loved those. And then the final thing was... A pack of hair baubles. They are quite literally clip-on baubles that you clip in your hair. <laughs> I don't know if you can see but this is what it's meant to look like if you wear all of them. Maybe next December I will wear hair baubles all month. I don't think I'll do that. <laughs> I also got this little cat thing. I don't think this was... No. This was a prize that I won on Christmas Day. Yeah, we did a game and I won this. This was from my nan. It's a little cat measuring cup thing. I think they're measuring cups, yeah. Oh yeah, my mum also did moon a little stocking. Obviously all of the things inside it are now strewn across the house because he's been playing with them. But yeah, there was just a bunch of little cat toys in there and he loves them so much. Like, yeah, but I wanted to show you the stocking that it came in because it literally looks like him. And finally from my mum and dad, we got a tin of Oreo which look delicious and I also got this box of jelly beans and I think I'd said to my mum that I just always crave jelly beans I don't know what it is I just randomly crave them so <laughs> it's a bit weird I know my brother got me these really cute little copper photo frames and he put these pictures of moon in them they are just so cute we didn't have any pictures of moon we have a picture of Millie but we didn't have any pictures of moon yet so I'm really excited to put these up somewhere in the house and oh he just looks so damn cute so I absolutely love those so Alex's parents got me this really cute necklace it's a little rose gold necklace and then I, I really don't know if you're going to be able to see it from there I really hope you can it's got a little heart on the end and then there's a little pig on there as well it's so cute when I saw it I was just like oh my god that is a pig isn't it that is a little pig's face like peeking over the edge it's so adorable I just don't know if you guys will see it from here because it's quite small but, uh, but if I do that it'll go out of focus the struggle and then also to go with the necklace they got me a couple of a couple of earrings, a pair of earrings, a pair of earrings, and they actually match really well because they've also got these little love hearts on them and they're rose gold and silver. They look so cute. They're just little like dangly earrings. So I absolutely loved them. So Alex's brother Dom got me the cutest case for my Nintendo Switch. Look at it. It's Mario's dungarees. Isn't that just the best thing you've ever seen? And then to get into it, you unpop her, his dungarees. So you're basically like, you know, taking them off. A little bit cheeky really and then you unzip it and it's got like a load of compartments in it for different things you've got a little slot and then a little bit for the games and then you zip it back up and you can clip his dungarees back down and you're good to go so i just thought that was the cutest case i've ever seen so my manager got me this candle and it's a dip Teak, I think that's how you say it, a diptyque candle. It's the, oh no, it's in another language. Sapin de Lumiere. I don't know if I said that right. It's all you could smell and it's amazing because we didn't have a real Christmas tree. So it doesn't really have that, well, obviously it doesn't have that Christmas tree smell because it's not real. But this to me smells like a real Christmas tree. So oh, I love it. Like I absolutely love it. It just smells amazing so i was very thankful for that so my nan and granddad got us a toasty maker which oh my goodness i've wanted one of these ever since i moved out and i don't know why i haven't bought one it's just one of those things that i've really wanted but i've never bought one for myself i used to always use our toasty maker when i lived with my mom and dad and ever since moving out I've not had as many toasties, obviously, because I haven't had a toasty maker. I'm really excited to use this and to finally have toasties again. <laughs> My nan and granddad also got me this really nice pink scarf. It's so soft and it's just really cute, obviously. Oh, I dropped the hanger. Obviously, I need to put it on briefly like you do. There we go. And yeah, that's such a nice little scarf. And then they also got me a couple of bits from Benefit and it came in this really cute little makeup bag, which is just so cute. It's like a glittery rose gold makeup bag. And then inside, there's this adorable mirror that matches the makeup bag and also, a little product in there which i've never even heard of i opened it and i was like oh it's the their real mascara because i saw 
they're real. Turns out it's not. It's the They're Real Double The Lip, I think it's called. It's basically a lipstick and a lip liner, I think. So yeah, I'll have to give that a go. It's in the shade Juicy Berry. And then they also got me this really whoa <laughs> they also got me this really cute little jewelry box and it's kind of like mirrored all around the edges and then the top has these like jewels on it is it is it a jewel you know what i mean and then inside oh what is that inside it's just like that really nice jewelry box material my other nan and granddad actually gave me money for christmas which was so kind of them and then they also got me this reed diffuser and hand cream yeah it's hand cream oh no and they got they also got me a box of Maltesers. These are the best ones in the cele is it the celebrations? Yeah, the Maltesers are definitely the best ones in the celebrations and this is a whole box of them. So yum. So my aunt and uncle got me a load of little bits in, well, it was in this bag, but this is the bag that I had to take them out of because Moon just kept climbing in it. It's so cute. Firstly, it's a little copper like basket. I guess you could put anything in there like a little storage basket and then they also got me these copper fairy lights which you know me i love me some fairy lights i love me some copper so i'm sure these will go oh these will definitely go up somewhere in the house and then they also if you're wondering what these are these are balls <laughs> some bull ball balls they got me these adorable copper ball ball balls which are so cute i mean you could actually just hang them up in the house i don't think they have to be christmas ball ball balls but i don't know i might put them up around the house or i might save them for next year and maybe we'll do a copper tree next year. And then my other auntie got me a Cadbury's selection box and I feel like it's just not Christmas unless you get one of these. So my best friend Sarah got me this really cute little Aries book and I find star signs and stuff like that so interesting. I love reading horoscopes and I always like end up googling stuff about star signs. I don't even know if it's true but I don't really care. I just like reading about it anyway. So this was such a cute gift. Your star sign secrets. Do you look like an Aries? Okay wait I just want to know that. You are one of the easiest signs to recognize by the way you walk. You have your head thrust forwards as you hurry often in a rush to get from a to b i tell you that's not me love i walk pretty slow <laughs> red is your color i'm wearing red right now it knows <laughs> it says that i would suit red hair or hair that has a reddish tinge complete with sun-kissed freckles i don't have freckles the classic aries has a sharp profile angular features high cheekbones a prominent nose well yeah i definitely got that haven't i i'm excited to have a good read of it because yeah i really love reading stuff like this i also got sent a present from beauty bay which was so kind of them and inside it i had a little card and it said open on christmas day it says sophie thank you so much for all of your support this year we love you team beauty bay so that was really cute and then they sent me a few little Little goodies so let's have a look so we've got this color palette in the shade bright and inside it are some hella bright colors like they are seriously bright but they look really really cool so that's the first thing i also got the i wonder 12 piece eye brush set and i know what you're thinking this is exactly what i needed because i'm always using the same eyeshadow brushes and you guys always say you need to get some more or you need to get some smaller ones i feel like amongst all of it here, here, here. Huh? I feel like amongst these, there is definitely going to be some smaller ones. Like, I can see smaller ones. I also got a couple of these fantastic, fantastic, huh? And these are lipsticks. And this one's in the shade... I think it's in the shade You're Freaking Awesome. I, I don't really know. But it's like, oh, it's like a really dark purpley colour. So that looks really cool. And then the other one is in the shade You're a goddamn goddess i think those are the shades unless they've just randomly written that on it i don't know and this one is just a really nice like nudie color i feel like this is definitely my kind of color so again i'm excited to try those i also got a core crayon in the shade black i think it's just like a little coal pencil eyeliner i'm not sure let me have a look yeah it's just like a black eyeliner pencil and then i also got a couple of face masks this is a charcoal peel off mask and this is a calming eye mask and they're both from the the brand yes to tomatoes i think that's what it's called oh wait this one says yes to tomatoes this one says yes to cucumbers and i just thought that was so nice of them to send over a little christmas present so thanks guys so obviously me and alex did our gift giving video which was for like our kind of novelty gifts to each other but those weren't our main gifts i've obviously given him a main present and he gave me just a couple of things i told him not to get me anything because i always just say just save you money but he got just like a couple of little things which was really sweet basically i'm the sort of person that has a dream every single night i dream all the time and i always remember them when i wake 
up and then by the end of the day I'm like oh Alex I had this dream last night and I'm like damn it I can't remember it now like by the time he's home I can't remember it properly so this is so cute it's a dream journal and you basically like write down your dreams and there's loads of little like it's set out really nicely and it's just a good way to like record your dreams well not actually record them oh my goodness could you imagine if you could actually like record them and watch them back I don't think I'd want to watch some of the things I dream of I tell you <laughs> not in like a weird way. well sometimes in a weird way. And then also, because I dream a lot, I'm always like looking into what my dreams could possibly mean. Like I find it so interesting. And this is the element encyclopedia of 20,000 dreams. So it basically tells you what your dreams could possibly mean. And it's a big fat book, like it is huge, but it means that I don't have to Google it. I can just have a flick through my book and see what my dreams mean. So he also got me another present, but he said it hasn't turned up yet because he didn't realize it was coming from America, but he showed me a picture of it because he's not sure how long it's gonna take to come. So he showed me a picture and I'm gonna, well, I'll put the picture on the screen here, but it's this really cute little necklace. And in the picture, it's got like some long ones and then a small one. I don't know why there's long ones. He said it's not those. It's the little one that's like a gold necklace around here. And it's got a little like dangly um, moon and star going across it. And I absolutely love it. Like he showed me the picture and I was just like, yes, I love that so much. So I'm so excited for it to come. And when it does, I'll be sure to wear it in a video so I can show it to you guys. I think that is everything that I got for Christmas. So thank you so much. If anyone is watching who got me a gift, I really don't know if anyone would be, but if you are thank you so much i absolutely love everything that i got and yeah i hope you guys had an amazing christmas yeah i'll see you guys in 2019 which is crazy like how is it already nearly 2019 i really hope you guys enjoyed this video give it a big thumbs up if you did thanks for watching and i'll see you next year <laughs> bye